Ah, Exodus chapter 22, verse 8. And whatever is injured covertly, whether ox or ass or sheep or raiment, of whatever is so lost, he shall make oath when he when he saith that it so it is and when the thing stolen shall be afterward found in the hand of the thief the cause of both shall be brought before the judges the cause of the householder and the cause of the thief and whom the judges shall condemn the thief shall restore twofold to his neighbor all right so and about whatever is covert, what is injured covertly, so secretly injured, either ox or ass or sheep or clothes or whatever is lost or stolen, and he shall make an oath, right? So that it is, when the stolen thing shall be afterward found in the hand of the thief, meaning the Most High is going to bring this about. He's going to bring this revelation to light. So... I was just talking about this in the last video about how, you know, everything's going to be brought up to the most high. So when the thief be found at a later time, then both shall be brought before the judges. This is a common practice here. Word of mouth does not work. They, if they, someone says you were, imp, if you are implicated in an issue or a matter, they bring you in too. You, all right. So you, so-and-so was there. He said, what? All right, go bring so-and-so. We're not discussing this no further until so-and-so come. I need to hear from him. It's a wonderful thing. So you bring both of them to the house, and we're going to deal with them, and we're going to deal with this issue, you know, on the spot. And when the thief, the thief shall restore twofold to his neighbor, period. So, like I said, two for one, two for one. This is what, we, this is what you get on this particular matter. All right, this is how it works. So I'm going to continue on. If a man deliver his ox, if a man deliver to his neighbor all ox or sheep or any animal to keep, he is to keep it without recompense. Right? So if I deliver an ox to you and I say, hey, man, I need you to just take care of it for me. And it die, or be torn by a wild beast, or carried off, and no witnesses seeing who can testify it, an oath of, of Yahweh shall be between them both, that he hath not put forth upon the property of his neighbor, and the owner shall accept his oath, and shall not be required to make it good. So again, if you just hold it for me without recompense, I didn't pay you to keep it right now notice the most high is making it 